I am very excited about this. I have fallen in love with Clarins as has literally everyone else in the business since we've been trying out the Clarins products. I've never tried a Clarins primer before. So I'm very, very intrigued to see what's gonna happen and if it's gonna work. I've particularly gone for the mattifying primer because as previously stated in other videos, I do get very oily skin, unfortunately. So I really need something that's gonna be able to mattify that and take down the oil because I can just feel it coming in in the afternoon. And it's just like, oh, not nice. Because of the oiliness, my makeup does also tend to droop a bit, particularly on my eyelids. I get a lot of the product rolling up and just kind of generally disappearing. So I'm hoping that that's going to be able to help with that. This also blurs pores as well, which I'm really interested about. I've never tried anything pore blurring before, so I'm really curious to see how that's going to work. Ooh, interesting. So it comes up with this kind of peachy, creamy color. Ooh, that's such a nice texture like really, really light, really lightweight. There's just something about Clarins products where they just feel really nourishing to your skin. Like it does, it almost feels like skincare. Oh, the mattifying element is coming in. I can feel it. I can really feel it starting to mattify. Oh, lovely. And it's getting um, almost a bit of traction there. So I can already feel, ooh, and a little bit sticky. So I think that's gonna be a really good base for my makeup. Ooh, lovely. Oh, and it's, it mattifies so quickly, wow. Wow, it's all, it's gone, it's gone. My hand is feeling incredibly smooth. Oh, I'm already, I'm very excited already to put this on my face. This is the Clarins SOS primer specifically targeted at signs of fatigue. I have been feeling pretty fatigued this year. It is only May and I'm feeling pretty burnt out already. I'm hoping this is gonna give me a little burst of energy, a little new lease of life on my face. I don't have that much experience using primers. I have used them in the past, but I don't always use them under my makeup. So I'm hoping that this is gonna convert me. I don't always wear a lot of makeup, so I'm planning on trying this out uh, just without makeup as well as under makeup to see if it can help give me a little bit more wow of a healthy, fresh faced look. Look at that shimmer. It's almost got like a pinky shift to it that's a little bit like mermaid-esque, iridescent. Ooh, smells nice absorbs in nice and quickly, and then starts to kind of smooth and give you that nice soft face for when you do decide to wear makeup. But yeah, I'm thinking that like, this is probably just gonna help me out on days when I'm not gonna wear makeup too. So when you put this on, you can almost basically instantly see that there's more of a glow, giving you that sort of lit from within look. So I can already see that that's gonna help me counteract that sort of like dullness that I've been experiencing. Um, probably be quite nice for highlighting under my eyes as well to give them like a bit of a, a bit of a boost. I get quite a lot of redness on my skin. I tried a couple of different primers. So I thought when this came out, I was like, oh, I really want to try it because I think it will be, will be great for summer, especially using it on, on the foundation. And I'm, I'm going to try it as a light moisturizer as well, just to see if that can like, use the redness anyway. So it's really nice and green very light green. It's feels very light on the skin. I think it will be nice hydrating. It will be nice and simple to wear. And it's also disappeared on the, on the skin, so that'll be perfect. We'll definitely try to wear it without anything, but we'll see how it goes when I put the foundation on it. So that will be interesting to see. I picked this one. I was really excited to try it because it's going to blur imperfections and uneven skin tone, which I do have. So hopefully if I use this primer before my other creams or foundations, I'll just have a really nice, more even coverage. Ooh, very peach. I might put a bit much on there. Okay, but it's blending nicely. Oh, actually I can already see it on my hands because I have a little mark there that's already being covered up. Oh, that's really nice, yeah. Melted in so well to my skin. Yeah, there's not much fragrance there either, which is good. Ooh, lovely. <laughs> I use primer every day, but I never use the primer from Clarence. I have a last pores and sometimes my skin, uh, it doesn't have any glow. This uh, primer promises glow. That's the reason I wanted it. The other thing is that I wanted to use it by itself or to mix it with my foundation to see how it works. 
and uh, I'm really intrigued to try the product this month. Yeah, it's, it's a white, creamy, but so fast absorbing texture. It doesn't leave any sinus and it smells really nice. It doesn't have any specific scent. It's so creamy, but it's not sticky. It doesn't leave any sinus or any colors or any greasiness. 